imagine your dad dying and your mom neglecting you and grieving all day? Despite being ignored during childhood, Sonia Sotomayor rose above his appointment and grew up to be a Supreme Court judge. Sonia Sotomayor was born on June 25, 1954, in a tiny microcosm of Hispanic New York City. When she was not quite eight, Sonia was diagnosed with diabetes and she learned courage because she had to give herself an insulin shot every day for the rest of her life. Growing up, Sonia Sotomayor had one younger brother named Juan Luis Jr. Sotomayor. Her parents highly valued education and tried to enroll Sonia and her brother into the best schools possible, even if her family did not have a high social status because they were Hispanic. From elementary to high school, Sonia Sotomayor attended Blessed Sacrament, and for college, she studied at Yale Law School, Princeton, and the New York County District Attorney's Office. Sonia Sotomayor was Hispanic, so she was often discriminated against. This experience encouraged her to work hard in school to show that just because she is Hispanic, that did not mean she was not as smart or good in school. Another experience Sonia had was when her father died when she was nine. Her mother began to ignore Sonia and her brother and spent a long time in grief. Because of this, Sonia realized she had to depend on herself and her brother. This experience and others helped shape Sonia Sotomayor so that she followed her dreams and is still leaving a lasting legacy in the judiciary. Some of Sonia Sotomayor's accomplishments include graduating with high honor from Princeton and Yale Law School. Then she served as a judge to the U.S. District Court, Southern District of New York, and the United States Court of Appeals for the Second Circuit. In May 2009, President Barack Obama nominated her to be the first Hispanic and third woman on the Supreme Court. She is still serving as Associate Justice of the Supreme Court. Sonia Sotomayor should be remembered in history because she's a very successful woman, even though she was born into a very poor family and she has diabetes. She also has faced discrimination because she's Latina, but she graduated from top schools and became a justice on the Supreme Court. I studied Sonia Sotomayor because she proved that even though she was born into a poor family, was discriminated against and contracted diabetes at a very young age, she was able to rise above all that and become a very successful woman. Thank you.